uh, uh, good evening. Uh, hi, hi, everyone. I, I'm Ismo, and yes, I am from Finland. <laughs> hey. hey, thanks a lot. I, I've been in America now for for almost four years, and and my English is is pretty good now. But I keep learning new words all the time, and and this is my favorite word so far. This is the best word here. I didn't know about this until recently, but I'm, I'm sure you you know this. Um, uh, the, the, the meaning of the word, it means that you have now poured enough coffee into my cup. <laughs> and, and it goes, it goes like... Did you know? I, I didn't know about that. I didn't know, but now, now I do, and I love it. It's so good. I, I use it all the time. It, it took me some time to figure out uh, how to how to spell it, <laughs> but now I have it. Now actually, I use it as my password. <laughs> it's, it's it's my Wi-Fi password. If somebody comes over, what's your Wi-Fi? <laughs> I really really like that. I, I I get stuck on words all the time. Like I really I like words, and this is a thing I hear often. If if somebody here uses a bad word, like a curse word. And then there's some other person who, who doesn't like that word being used and they want to interfere and say something. The thing they always say, they always yell out, uh, language. <laughs> like, uh, y yeah, okay. Uh, uh, yeah, language, yes. Uh, this, this is a part of that. <laughs> like, yes, this goes into the category of uh, language. <laughs> But isn't it like a little bit broad of a thing to say in that situation? Like, to me, it's like the same. If you see somebody about to get hit by a bus and you yell out, uh, transportation. <laughs> like, yes, yes, you are correct. Yes, this. Uh, <laughs> This does go under the umbrella of transportation. <laughs> it's, just, it's just too broad. <laughs> I know my, my English is far from being perfect. Like, I don't speak perfect English by far, but recently I realized that there are some people who speak way worse English than me. Like, way worse. I heard that there's an actual campaign, a huge campaign that's been going on now to teach people, uh, to teach people that um, uh, no means uh, no. <laughs> That's, that's, uh, that's pretty basic level. Uh, that's like English 101. <laughs> I, I, I thought that's like one of the easiest words. But, but maybe we have a problem that some people don't know. No. And, uh, and we, 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 we have to teach. <laughs> It's, it's just like, if that's the case that somebody doesn't know, no, then my question is that, is it even helpful? Is it helpful to, to, to have a campaign? Like, is it helpful to define a word by... <laughs> like, using the same word? Is it the same? Like, no means no. Well, pro probably. Yeah. <laughs> that, that, that would have been my first guess, yeah, because... Uh, because it is the exact same word, so I would assume it might also mean the same <laughs> thing. That's how words work normally. But, like, if somebody doesn't know the first no, I, I bet they won't know the second no either. <laughs> there, there is zero new information in that campaign. But, but I've been thinking about it, and I think we should change that campaign just a little bit to make it way more helpful. I think we just tweak it a bit. I think it should go like this. I think it should go like, no means... <laughs> <laughs> hey, thanks a lot. Thank you.